You may have heard the terms push or pull when it comes to MIG welding and wonder what is the difference and why would I use one over the other? Let's start with the pull technique. Always read and follow all labels and the owner's manual. With the pull technique, you're gonna get a little bit deeper penetration, a little stronger weld, but one of the big disadvantages is it leaves a little more rounded weld bead and it just doesn't look as nice. An example where I would use that though is maybe butting two I-beams together where you have an eighth inch gap or so, and then you can really get down in there and penetrate where you need to. Now the push technique, the weld on there ties into the base metal on the edges a little better, so it leaves a flatter bead and a little better appearance. One example where I use that is welding furniture, which I do quite a bit here in the shop, and it leaves a nice flat weld bead and looks good once it's painted. Each technique can be used to make a good weld, and hopefully this will help you decide which is best for your situation.